Agora Babylon is the Vatican II sect, a false bride, which arises in Rome in the last days in order to attempt to deceive the Catholic faithful. In her appearance at La Salette, France, September 19, 1846, the Blessed Mother predicted, quote, Rome will lose the faith and become the seat of the Antichrist. The church will be in eclipse. In the following quote, Antipope Paul VI admits his new church is this false church by admitting that his church has thrown off its opposition to the world, which characterizes the true church. Paul VI, General Audience, October 1, 1969. On the other hand, she, the church, is also trying to adapt herself and assimilate herself to the world's ways. She is taking off her distinctive sacral garment, for she wants to feel more human and earthly. She is tending to let herself be absorbed by the social and temporal milieu. She has almost been seized by human respect at the thought that she is different in some way and obliged to have a style of thought and life which is not that of the world. She is undergoing the world's changes and degradations with conformist, almost avant-garde zeal. Here Paul VI admits that the post-Vatican II church is a false church which has adapted itself to the world and assimilated the world's ways with zeal. This is a stunning admission by Paul VI. He is admitting in so many words that the post-Vatican II church is the whore of Babylon. Paul VI death. After Paul VI death in 1978, there was no crucifix nor even a cross in the tomb when his body was placed for veneration in St. Peter's Square. It was simply a wooden box. And this is precisely how Jews are buried, in a plain wooden box. Here is a statement of a Jewish